We are going to install OpenStack Fuel on virtual machine and the simplest way to install Fuel is to download Mirantis OpenStack bootable ISA. You need a hypervisor, you can use VirtualBox, I will use KVM and Virtual Machine Manager. Before creating a Fuel VM you need to create a new network. So go to connection details and create a new virtual network. Let's call it admin and the address is 10 20 0 0. You need to disable DHCP and enable NAT because few node will require access to the internet. OK, we have a new virtual network. Let's create a new virtual machine for Fuel node. Let's call it Fuel. We will use ISA to boot. Here is my Mirantis OpenStack ISA. I downloaded it before. Let's use 4 gigs of memory and 2 CPUs. This is a bare minimum for Fuel Master node. And the disk size is 65 gigabytes. Let's save some space by not allocating the entire disk now. Okay, let's check that a new VM is connected to admin network. Okay, that's it. The installation has been started. Let's wait some time. Okay, fuel has been installed and now it shows me fuel menu in text mode to change settings. I will use default settings, so I don't need to change anything here. So I need to choose good without saving. That's it. Let's wait more time while Fuel finalizes the installation. Okay, the installation has been completed. So it's time to check if Fuel has been installed. Let's go to 10.20.02 address. Okay, here is it. Use admin admin for the username and the password. Okay, so now Fuel is building a new bootstrap image which will be used to discover other nodes. So let's wait 15 to 20 minutes while it is building the bootstrap image. Finally, the bootstrap image has been built and I received a notification that default bootstrap image building done. Now you can boot new nodes over Pixie and so on. So you have installed your fuel node and now you are ready to use it to deploy OpenStack environments. Thank you.